you know, Hesed has a shit list, and I, I, I decided to add, uh, would you rather? So, we, we came into this weird talk today, which is how Golden Showers got brought up, but we're talking about all these weird things, and so I want to add a chick list, and all it is going to be is a shout out to whatever chick is fine to us, and that's no disrespect to our, you know, correspondent significant others, right? You know, <laughs> but uh, we're just going to add chick lists to the would you rathers, and so... The initial talk was me and Hesse were going to make an all-star team, right, where it's going to be like 10 of these fine chicks. But we just decided we could just do a chick list because, I mean. We like could, we could do a different girl each week. They could be, be like, hey, like there's girl. You're so many girls it. everywhere. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah. I, golly. So uh, we're going to add a chick list to it. And so we're going to chick list this first week. My chick list is Scarlett Johansson. She's acted in multiple things. I'm pretty sure most of you guys that are listening to me right now have seen her in a movie. That definitely has to be my number one chick list today. We're going to keep it at one, guys, because me and Heston could say like 30 every episode. So we're just going to say one and move along. So Scarlett Johansson (laughs) is mine for this first week. And uh, we're going to keep it right there. Uh, Heston, how are you feeling on a chick list? Who's your chick list of the week? Uh, My my entry for the chick list this week is going to be Demi Lovato. I think she's... She's fine as but fuck. But she really is, though. <laughs> yeah, she's fine as fuck. And she, um, and she's cool, too, because she's, like, like she was, like, that stereotypical, like, glamorous, like, famous person. Right. And then, like, she had, like, the eating disorder and then, like, the drug problem. The drug. And then, like, she came back from that. Yep. And now she's, like, got her shit together. And Looking she's, like, legit. fine as fuck. And she's, like, at a healthy weight. And, like, she looks fucking good, there bro. There we go. So yeah, so you got Demi Lovato. Demi Lovato, bro. Deal. Anyone who hasn't seen what she looks like now, like check her out, bro. Like, oh my god, she does look. She uh, looks I, amazing. I, I, I can tell you right now, look, <laughs> yeah. when, she, when she made cool for the summer, which is gonna be my shout out later in the show. Okay, so I'm gonna just say my shout out. I guess cool for the summer is my shout out. Uh, and, Friday banger. Uh, yeah, my yeah. Friday banger. Uh-huh. But my, you know, uh, cool for the summer, Demi Lovato. Um. I only learned her because of that song, and and so I can definitely attest to what Hessen is saying. So. Hell yeah! Well, I definitely Hell have yeah. to throw that out there. So okay, let's, right, let's move into would these. Rathers. Would you rather's, bro? Are you ready? I'm ready. So again, we always keep them in order. They're gonna. To me, I try to do them sure, like easiest easy, medium, hard. to toughest. Right. And so I actually could have interchanged all of these questions. Okay. They're they're all I think gonna be a little bit like cool. a little tough. So, um, would you rather know the date of your death or the cause of your death? The date. You'd rather know the date? Yeah. So, you'd rather know what day you're going to die, but not know how you're going to die? I'm fine with that. I'd rather know the cause of my shit. No. I'd rather know the cause. I'd like, rather... I, I want to know, like, am I, go, am I about to get hit in a car accident? Or <laughs> am I going to, like, slip and fall? Am I going to break my neck? Am I just going to die in my sleep? Like, I feel like I feel like I, if you knew... I feel like if you knew how you were going to die... you try to prevent it. You'd be it. in a con... No because, you're, no, because even if you try to stop it, that's still how you're going to die. Well, so this question is like Final Destination. Well, like, sort of, yeah. It, but you here's know, the like, thing, right? Here's the thing, right? <laughs> if you know how you're going to die, you're going to be perpetually in a state of fear for, like, the rest of your life. But it doesn't you know matter because coming. you still no i i feel like you you will be more scared if you know the day you're gonna die like i don't think so bro i feel like so right now right if somebody said if i told you right now heston you're gonna die in your sleep that would be your cause of death right yeah if i told you you're gonna I'd die be, i'd be scared as shit like hold on, every right, night to go to go to sleep yeah, right yeah but if i told you you're gonna die on november the first cool what what what's today's date uh 10, 12. How scared would you be, nigga, like, coming up to that day, like, what, how the fuck am I going to die? Like, what's nice going to happen? It'd like, be nice that I know it. So, I appreciate you that you picked. Well, if you know the day that you're going to die, you can, like, get everything arranged. You're like, all right, look, like, here's my will. Like, this is all good. And then, like, you can also, like, not give a fuck, too. Like, you can live without fear because you're like, I'm not going to die today. Like, I'm going to do whatever the fuck I want today. But, but, but hold on. Can't you just do the same thing knowing the cause of your death? I uh, know. I don't think Why so. Why not? Because you don't know which time is going to be the you, time. You don't know when it's going to happen, but you know how it's going to happen. So wouldn't you just do the same thing that you would do knowing the date of your death? No, because you know you're not going to die before that. So, so you you're telling you me if I told you you're going to die in your sleep, you still wouldn't have a will ready or like a like you. So you'd procrastinate is basically what you're saying. If yeah, you knew, I am right now, unfortunately. If, if you, right. If you knew the time of your death, you'd procrastinate. 
versus knowing well, when, no, when you would, you would you would just know like how long you got, <laughs> and then you so can, then you'd make those moves. Uh, yeah, but you wouldn't make those moves before. I mean, you should. I just I but haven't. But you yet, wouldn't you know. until like okay. So I I love that. Yeah. I love that. And and I'm glad. Again, I don't want us to agree. I yeah, just like yeah. to hear your additional takes because mm-hmm. I definitely would pick. I want to know how I'm gonna die. Like, yeah. I want to fuck when like that can happen tomorrow i'm I'm okay with that but how though like i'm all about to drown no, I, like so that for and, me you know, it's like, just for me it's just like it, it'd give me peace of mind like if i knew when it was gonna happen i'd be like okay and then see, like and then like once that day happens like, that. like all right this is it man i like, like that yeah i get more peace of mind knowing how i'm gonna die that's because, weird i because, don't understand bro, that if, if if i go see how i'm gonna die and i get shot 13 times i'm kind of like what the hell was i doing to that i'm gonna get shot 13 times like or yeah, I like it's it's easier for me to know how I'm going to die than to know like when I'm gonna die because okay, but I, I like your method because you're uh-huh. like it's more sure you can get an order yeah like yeah well I, I'm 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 a planner yeah so <laughs> all right so hey it's gonna get a little crazy okay would you rather have your parents walk in on you while you were doing it or accidentally walk in on them doing it I've already had my mom walk in on me while I was doing it and- me too. Well, so I picked this question because I would literally pick. I'd rather walk in on my mom. Why? Because I've had the option of being walked in <laughs> on, and it is not cool at all. Like, well, my mom was like cool about it when it happened. She's well, just like, oh, and then just like closed the door. My and mom was, was like, not uh, really that cool with it. Oh, okay. Well, all. that's different. And yeah. so it is different, but bro, I'm mid stroke. Like I, I meant some <laughs> shit. I, I, I'm having fun. Sure. It is not cool for somebody. Uh-huh. You know, like, yeah, it, it, it's. I don't think that it's that cool for, because all that happens at that point is right. You're like in it, and uh-huh. you good, <laughs> and then somebody just walks in, and you're in the middle of like, bro. So in my situation, I just jumped up, smooth off the vagina, and just like, I mean, yeah, that's all you can do. And then now your mom's just and uh, whoever walks in, I was just staring at like both of y'all like in well, mid moment. Well, see, someone like, that makes it weird though. Like, for, like, like I said, with my mom, like she just opened the doors, like oh, and then just like closed it, and then like. So I feel like it would be the same. And, you know, throw some if pants I walked in on, on my so mom, she'd be like, or, hey, that was dad. weird. My bad. If I walked in on my mom or dad, like, hey, mom, like, you know, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And walk in, oh shit, my fault. Like, I think it'd be better for me to cope with like walking in on them t- than I've got walked in on and I did not like it. Now I've walked in on people fucking right, but like my homeboys. Yeah, you're. And shit. Yeah, so that's it's like, different. Hi, yeah. my bad. Ah. You know, we're all laughing and <laughs> yeah, stuff. Yeah, like yeah. you can hear them laughing yeah, back, yeah, like yeah. hitting the doors. Like ah, I goofy, don't come in here. Like, uh-huh. I think it'd be, I, I'd be okay with. I'd rather walk in on my parents, which I don't know my dad, but I know my mom. Sure. So I, I could just say I'd rather walk yeah, in yeah, on my I mom, like yeah. ooh, than her, like the way she came in and what happened. Like no, <laughs> okay. no. Okay. <laughs> But I agree with you. So you'd rather have? I'd rather have my mom walk in on me, just because it's already happened. Which so you did, like, whatever. So, yeah. Um, I kind of forget that would be a, a, an easy one, maybe for you, but that's still also a tough one. For I think some for people. some people, that's a much harder question. Because me, I've been walked in on. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I would rather walk in on sure. my mom. Like yeah. I don't. I would not. I did not like her. I get it. I was not cool. Okay. It just wasn't cool. Now, would you rather? Drink all the half-finished drinks in a bar or eat all the half-finished food at the end of the night? (laughs) Yo, that's tough, bro. It's tough. They both sound terrible. They both are terrible. That's why I picked this one. (laughs) And, like, I'm a lot less picky with alcohol than I am with food. With food? I'd probably do the alcohol, man. I like that answer. Yeah. I would do the food. I do the food because there's so many drinks that I feel like I really wouldn't drink. Even though there's a lot of food that I feel like I wouldn't eat, it's uh-huh. a bar. So yeah. there's only oh, that's certain a good point. food, it's bar food. that's going to be served. That's a good so point. So I'd probably rather eat whatever food you got because y'all be getting some weird drinks that, that have light liquor. I'm that's a dark true. liquor drinker. Yeah, yeah, so I'm going to yeah. just be drinking anything. I, I I end up probably like just throwing myself up, like you know. So think you about how much drink drinks, that could be though too. Pick, you could throw up just from over engorging. Yeah, it, <sighs> that's why I was like, it doesn't. It sounds like a lose. But I mean, if me. it's like a burger and it's wings and then it's mozzarella sticks and it, I mean all this shit sounds like it's kind of good, right? And, and all you really have to do is get past like the initial bite of like it's whatever true. you're looking at, it's right? True, After though. that, it's all you. Like, yeah, that's a good point. You know what I mean? Yeah. And with drinking. 
you all you got to do is get past that first sip, right? But I mean, what if it's a drink that you don't really? That's a good point, and that's with, rough. Like, and that's rough. It's tough because you have to drink that whole thing. Yeah, and you're not done. You but how many people to... are leaving full ass drinks? So too, it, though? Did, like... it did not give an answer, but you would have to expect people get a ton of food. People buy hella drinks at a bar. Yeah, so would but you rather like, have how many people are drinks? not finishing their drinks at the bar though? That's what I'm saying. Like but, a lot of those are going to be like almost empty. You see what I'm saying? So which one would you rather pick? I think I'm going to stick drinks. with drinks. Yeah, I think I'm going to stick so with I drinks. So I picked food, but I'm also a foodie, right? So, right, right, right. I mean, all this uneaten food, I definitely I definitely want it. I mean, yeah, yeah, if yeah. I'm just biting one bite after you on something, I, I, I'm okay with that. So mm-hmm. those are my would you rathers. And so I, I, I love it. Yeah, I love it. I, I, I love that your answers were completely different. That's yeah, just why same. I picked these because yeah. I, I pick them on, on a, a hindsight that you're going to pick a different answer yeah. and so yeah, yeah, yeah. it's perfect cool and so i'm glad that for the most part you did but i think if we were really in those situations you'd be like fuck i kind of like your answer right? yeah <laughs> I, I feel that you know because when you start getting all just all these weird drinks that you don't know what all these drinks are that's true though but then we just get like, a burger that, that you know has like bacon and cheese on it i mean you're probably gonna <laughs> tear the fuck up out of that burger like fuck who just that. ate it right yeah. and so they didn't say if it was cold or warm and i said we're expecting these meals to be warm and we would expect the dreams to be freshly made, like. Well, the, not really. I think the well, opposite. So the so the, we could the say the food have just sat, be and sat the food on, is cold. Yeah. and the drinks will be sat on with the right, ice right, with right. the ice in it. Mm-hmm. Right, I still pick food. Okay, I, I, that's cool. And you're you're a cold food eater, which is really weird about this, <laughs> yeah, but yeah. whatever, right? Like, <laughs> I don't know. There's something weird for me. Like, there's something weird about eating food from like another person that I'm not cool with. But like, you just drink anything that I, you're not I comfortable kind of, with drinking. Yeah, I don't know you, why. So you'd rather not eat. A food that you might like, but somebody else ate it. Yeah, to, and then to drink, or you'd rather yes. drink a drink yeah. that you'd never drink in your life. Yeah, I don't know why, but more than more than once though, because yeah. you're you're gonna get a, all right. the drinks that yeah, are left yeah. over. You'd right. rather do that. Mm-hmm. That's tough, I'm more right. comfortable drinking after somebody than eating after somebody. I don't know why, but just drinking drinks that you would never drink in your life. It's okay. That's tough. <laughs> Give me the food. I, I eat food all day, all I day. Feel anyway, that. I so. feel that. Give me the food. All right. Uh, well, yeah. we'll, we'll go ahead and wrap up here. Uh, tell us how y'all up. think uh, about the would you rather yeah, questions. Please, man. Please.